So that was an introduction to what is the difference between websites and web applications. So when we say a framework, hum exactly kya mean karte hain? A framework is just a bunch of code that does something functional. I'll repeat myself. It is just a bunch of code ki jo koi cheez karta hai. It is a set of practices jo humne utha li hai ki hume agar aisa implementation karna ho, to usko aise kiya jata hai. If you want ki ek dabbe mein if we search something, that, that word can be searched and through the entire catalog of products, then that is something that can be implemented by a framework. जब हम Amazon.in वाली वेबसाइट पे लिखते हैं कि हमें I want a blue colored लहंगा लेट से, then from that text to it showing us the list of लहंगा options, वो चीज कैसे हो रही है, background में कहां सर्च हो रहा है, क्या कर रहा है, that is being handled by the framework. वो as a developer हमें हर बार from scratch नहीं लिखना पड़ता है, that is something that is taken care of by the framework. A framework is essentially a common pattern of solving a common problem. Jo problems hume har jaga har taraf dikhai deti hai. Amazon, Flipkart, Snapdeal, Mintra, Nika. All of those are e-commerce portals and they all serve the same purpose. Serve the same purpose. Ki they show a list of products to users and users are supposed to buy something from them. Given that there is a common list of functionalities that they all need. Ki hume ye chahiye, ye chahiye, ye chahiye. Then it makes total sense ki abhi ye common functionality ke liye we do not reinvent the wheel each time search ki functionality ho gai or if there is any logic ki ye type karne se ye change aana chahiye so for that thing there is a framework which has a list of code which has an amount of code that is used and that can be reused each time so as a developer i don't have to worry about ki mera ek ek akshar type hoga to wo akshar kahan kahan jayega aur kaise kaise wo lehenga options fetch karke layega Instead, we will leave it to the framework. We'll just tell the framework what we want to be done and it is the job of the framework to actually implement it. Please do note this third point here very carefully. You do not have to reinvent a wooden wheel each time when you could instead use a good quality rubber MRF. Reinvent the wheel to nahi hi karna hai. But hamare paas already achha kaasa tire hai jo Indian roads pe chal sakta hai. So we don't use the wheel of the wheel when there is already a great list of functionality that has already been implemented by someone, then we do not need to go, go back to the drawing board each time. A framework is nothing new. It is just an easier already implemented way of doing the same stuff. And then I have put three words down. Tooling, compartmentalization and routing. Tooling means that a framework comes with a lot of tools that common functionalities ke use kar sakte Jaise for example, if we want to navigate between different components, like Amazon.in, if you want to search through various list of options, if you want to go to Amazon Pay or Amazon Fresh, each of these are different components on the Amazon website, on the Amazon application. That is being handled by the React framework or whatever framework Amazon uses. Compartmentalization means that you can isolate your code into sets of pieces which can be reused. Abhi aapka search wala dabba hai. That comes across 10 different places. Search wala dabba also comes on the Amazon homepage. Search wala dabba also comes on the Amazon fresh wala homepage. Search wala dabba same hi hai. Now you do not need to rewrite the code for that search wala dabba each time. Instead, you just want to reuse the code and it is this framework that allows you to reuse the code so that you do not need to repeat the same thing each time. And finally, routing. That is, like I mentioned, navigating between different parts of the application is much easier done through a framework. Varna, you have to write in that application that Amazon.in slash fresh or Amazon.in slash pay. Pe jao. Instead of doing that, what you can rather do is just uh, tell the framework ki when Amazon Pay is clicked, it should navigate to fresh or it should navigate to pay. Some common JavaScript frameworks are React. There is a question mark I'll answer as to why there is a question mark there. Angular, Vue, Ember. These are front-end JavaScript frameworks. They're similarly, there are a lot of back-end JavaScript frameworks as well, such as Nest.js or Node.js. Node.js is exactly not a JavaScript framework, but for right now, you can think of it that way. So essentially, the core take home point from here is that 
JavaScript frameworks simplify a lot of the work that you would otherwise have to do from scratch.